Shanghai, Chinatown. Now we are going to Chinatown. We just take a drive first around Chinatown. Uh, here is Chinatown. I took a bus, 53 bus passing here many, many times, but not be able to film very well because I was on the bus. Now it's uh, in the afternoon, five o'clock. Uh, not so many people yet, but in the evening, it's packed of people. I think today I did the best film. I just asked my friend to drive slowly <laughs> and uh, get the, the street. Uh, then we will park the car and uh, just uh, see the Chinatown. I am a Chinese descendant, but I don't really know much about the Chinese culture because I was born in the mainland China. Uh, mainland China cut all the Chinese culture after 1949. So I was brought up actually uh, with Mao, Mao Zedong's idea of life. So it's really not much to do with the traditional Chinese culture. Uh, it's only after I went to Australia, I start to realize that I know so little about the Chinese culture. Uh, I was not a real Chinese man, but I'm a, a, a man from the People's Republic of China. <laughs> so even I am Chinese origin, uh, Chinese culture still appear very foreign to me. I feel I know Western culture much more than Chinese culture. Another thing that I really don't like Chinese culture very much is that uh, uh, they always and only care for money. <laughs> okay, money, money, money. We want to make more money. So always my experience going to Chinese restaurant uh, I don't like. For example, uh, in India, I have been eating all this street food. There's no problem. But only because I went to the Chinese restaurant, I got poison. I got food poisoned. And I was uh, seriously sick. The worst of my life. <laughs> and this time I was in Huaqin. The most expensive food and uh, not good food I eat was a Chinese Ren Thai restaurant. Okay, this is why I'm sorry I'm Chinese. I don't like Chinese, <laughs> be very frankly. But I'm here in the Chinatown just to do the film and uh, for you, for your sake. Because Chinatown is part of the tourist attraction. And the people on the YouTube also write comments to me says, oh, make a video about Chinatown. Okay, now <laughs> I make a video for you. The Chinese always gold, gold, gold. <laughs> this is a Chinese school. Uh, this is inside the Chinese school. And uh, then you see a very old Mercedes Benz. And someone is fixed his mirror with tape. Almost fixed with a tape. Well done. Beautiful. Then two old Mercedes Benz over there. Uh, this is the school, but we get a shortcut from here. Someone carry her dog like that. Street cats. And this one is really lazy. Look. Ooh. Hmm? Not interested. How about this one? How about this one? <laughs> oh. 
Many people waiting here, waiting here. Looks like a very popular restaurant. But have to wait. I could. I think uh, that's the end and we can cross the road and uh, see the other side. Maybe if we find a place we can eat here. Or about Chinatown. Just to wonder what kind of food they are going to eat. We come back to this place with so many people, but I want to try. Okay. Is this place uh, famous or? No, I don't know. <laughs> you you know this place or you just come here because no. so many people? No, but it's 
seems it seems good that there are a lot of people, so I think oh, it's good. Oh, okay, okay. So you have no information before? No, no, no. Oh, idea. okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> Just wondering how good it is really is as so many people occur and we are waiting here too. Can I see your camera? You have very cool camera. Thanks, man. <laughs> Leica. Yeah. Wow. It's my dad is a, a little bit of a collector. Oh, okay, That's okay, how, I understand. Yeah. <laughs> Got quite lucky. Yeah. My brother collected Leica, so it's, oh, it's so real. You know? Okay, good luck. Thank yeah. you. you Chinatown in the evening, 6.30. Yeah, we come out to Chinatown, yes. Chinatown, bad evening. We'll drive through. Here, here, here. We just had dinner here. 